to a party, so we went there. Jeez, can y'all stop snapping? <laughs> All right, let's let her go for a while. Let's let her get some momentum up. Go ahead. Yeah, let me think of the story. Yeah. Okay, so I was drinking. We went to a party at an abandoned house, kind of. The pool boy threw the party while the people were out of town. We um, drove up a cliff, and how the houses are in Rincon, they're like hanging off the hills, just about. There's no flat surface there. Um, All right, I'm going to pause you. Forget about the M's and us for a minute. We're not going to focus on those. We're not going to snap. Why don't we work on something else? All right? So I want to hear what happens on the cliff. But first, I want you to do two things. I want you to stand straighter. Like this. And then we're going to do eye contact. All right? And, and what that will do for you is it will put a pause between each person that you speak to. So people might like take care of the moments. But it doesn't matter. We're not focused on that right now. We're focused on eye contact. So one person at a time, we're going to do whack a all right? Do we have the reason? Yes, they do. Um, hands up. Okay. So, sorry to start. Don't worry about that. Just ignore this. Okay. We went up a cliff to get to the to get to the party. While we're at the party, um, the guy that threw the party suggested that we go to the roof of the house, and how we were supposed to get to the roof of the house was we were supposed to shimmy across this little like platform kind of. So I'm already like kind of not in my mind because I've been drinking, I just turned 21. My friends, they go up the little side. And mind you, if I would have fall, like I would have fell into death down there. <laughs> so All right, I'm gonna pause you again. We're gonna, everybody put their hands down. We're gonna do, we're gonna narrow the universe a little bit. Kimber, Rachel, Brooke, and Felicia are your only people in your audience at the moment, all right? And you need to complete a thought with one of them at a time, but you really need to look at them. You actually have to try to figure out the color of their eyes okay. while you're talking to them, okay? Because okay. I'm seeing you kind of vaguely looking at people, but not really seeing their faces. Mm -hmm. So I think it'll calm you if you look at Kimber, look at Rachel, they're friendly people, they're not mean. Look, Brooke's friendly, she's fine, Felicia's nice. So one person at a time, just complete a thought. But these are everybody else, ignore them. Okay. All right. We shimmy across this pathway to get to the roof. My friends go, I stay behind because I'm not feeling it. I think I'm going to die. Okay, who were you looking at right then? Was it Brooke oh. or Felicia? Uh, I was kind of looking at her. Okay, so Felicia. make sure you. she knows you're looking at her and you know okay. she's looking at her. Okay. I stay behind at the party while my friends and the guy that threw the party goes to the roof. Um, Brooke? Brooke. I stay behind. They go to the roof. I'm not feeling the party, so I grow some guts. I have a mini panic attack. Then I proceed to go to the roof. When I get to the roof, I can see everything up there, the stars, the moon, lightning in the distance. Rachel. Uh, Rachel. Rachel needs to be. It was pretty relaxing. I got to see a shooting star. I made a wish. That was awesome going up there. And I thought about the travel back to the roof. I mean, back, yeah, from the roof to the party. Uh, I died again, came back to life. And then I went across, prayed while I went across, and then went back to the party. And that was it. Okay. It's like really hard. Horrible being up here. <laughs> <laughs> well, you survived. You did great. So, eye contact is a tough thing for you. But what happened at the end there when it was just the four? What happened to the ums and the uhs? They were pretty much gone. No, girl. Yeah. Oh, okay. yeah. There were a couple, but everybody has a couple. We're not saying you'll ever get rid of all of them. But when you were just focused on this, you were telling us a story, and you weren't nervous. Well, you were still nervous, but. 
you weren't as nervous because now you're just talking to a couple friendly people. Mm -hmm. What you want to do over time is just expand that universe of a couple friendly people to more and more people in the room mm -hmm. and make that connection. And you'll get, over time, you'll know these people that you're feeling comfortable. Mm -hmm. But watch on the video, you'll see a big difference with that eye contact. Yeah. All right, thank you for playing. Nice.